A little Godspeed on your 8,500 yard rainbow road. You're not? Good morning, everyone. Oh. It's 5 a.m. We're going to the pool extra early today because today is Wednesday. By the way, happy Black Friday, everyone. You guys are seeing this two days after I film this. A little bit of fun insider information for you. But today is the last practice for the college team before they get to go on break because they just had their mid-season meet, so they get their Thanksgiving break after today. So we have a morning swim that starts at 6 a.m. And then once the college team is done with their morning swim, they have the remainder of the week to go home. Now, I'm obviously not going anywhere because well I live here and also because I'm on taper for US Open now remember the title of my last video where I talked about the differences in swimming worlds the taper world versus the world of the grind that could not be highlighted more clearly than in this morning's very early practice now this is what I mean by that this morning, my main set is this, 450s descend one to four, and then four running dive 25s. And that's it. Gonna suit up to go extra fast, but it's just a glorious kind of day. But the rest of the team here, everybody else, I don't know so much about the sprinters, but the rest of everybody else is gonna be doing like 8,000 rainbow set, just a lot more painful. Could not be two more different worlds. Right on time this morning to get, get in the whole training group. Well, but, but, but we're not the full training group, though. We're the taper group. Your warm up starts with that. Okay, okay. We don't have to. Everybody's in the water at six. No ifs, ands, or buts. Bobby might even do a fast 25 breaststroke today because he's feeling frisky. It's that taper vibe. When that clock hits the next 60 minute mark, everyone in this pool will be jumping in on time. No exceptions. <sighs> oh my god. 20 seconds. It's about to happen. Up. Everybody's getting in. Everybody's getting in. All right, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Slightly more complicated than I said earlier, but still, the premise is the same. Four fast running dives, four to ten fifties. We got stations going on. We got 25s with hand socks right here, then the running dive station, then there's the swim out station then the 50 dive station, and then at the other end there's like a pulley station for people doing one fast 25 pulley with weight. And we're just like rotating through a few times. Don't, don't jump on top of each other, we don't want that. Here we go. One. And speed and power, baby. That one felt good. That one felt really good. Like I hit the line right when I hit the water. Woo! Here comes Laura. She's moving. She's flying. Flying. Go! Go! Wow. You look so fast. On to the pulley. Now we're hooked up. I'm gonna do one heavy pulley to about 15 meters. And then we do our dive 50. Let's go, girls. Lil, What's big up? Lil. Four nine. Four, four nine. My rate was a little bit lower on that one, should have been. Finished with our taper practice and these all these guys are just grinding it out right now, making me proud, doing the work for us. This place is legitimately close to the public. Like they got the locks up, the screens and everything. It's crazy. Guys, this is one of my favorite things in the world after practice. When I start to see the sun rising through those trees as I walk back to my car, there it is. It's coming up so pretty. Now, obviously, being on taper right now, I love it. I love that I get to taper. I get to feel fast. I get to do less. I just get to have all this energy. But there is a big part of me that's a little bit sad that I'm missing out on the grind right now. 
You know, here's the thing. The team right now is doing a ridiculously hard practice. Like everybody, over 8,000, a very grueling, mentally tough kind of set. And it's one of the best feelings in the world of accomplishing and getting through one of those sets knowing that you have a break on the other end. It's like light at the end of the tunnel kind of a thing. That's what they're all experiencing right now. It's just like true camaraderie. It's like a warrior's atmosphere. And I kind of miss that, just being in the trenches with everybody suffering together. I love being a part of that. What showtime do you want to go to, Allie? Maybe. You are a very strange woman. So some teachers use the word naughty to tell kids like, have you been naughty? Yeah. And I find it so weird and uncomfortable. <laughs> and, I, and I don't like them to use that verbiage. <laughs> this afternoon is a special one because we are going up to see our niece Isabel, who we call Iz, and we're gonna take her to see Frozen too. I actually really like the first Frozen. I'm pretty excited to see the movie. Allie got us Frozen t-shirts to wear at the movie. That's the shop from the movie, right? Yeah. Arendelle? Is that how you say it? Arendelle? Arendelle. Arendelle. We're gonna wear frozen t-shirts. You Half price boots! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm excited for the movie. That's what that is. You. You. I'm squeezing in is. I'm coming back there with you. <laughs> oh, let me get the door shut. All aboard! Okay, okay. Look what I have. You have an iPad? Yes. What? Watch. All right. Hey, is show she, for Allie to the movie she, theater, please. Is she in her seat? Al, are you in your seat? I. Allie is chauffeuring us to the movie theater. We're gonna go see Frozen two. I'm so excited. We we started her own pop collection. She's collecting Frozen pops now because we have the Harry Potter pops. And Who's that? This is on Elsa. Elsa's your fave? Yes. Oh. And in we go. All right, Iz, you pick the seat. We can sit wherever you want to sit. Anywhere you want, we can sit. Iz has decided we're gonna sit in the very back, so. The very back row for us. You taste her cotton candy right now. I haven't seen cotton candy movie there in a long time. It just melts in your mouth. Working daily to support the interests of local business owners in the Morrisville area. We provide valuable communication and networking possibilities for our members who are eager to support you. Here's your cotton candy. Here you go. We moved closer up because Iz couldn't see the screen from the back. For over 40 years. Do you want to stop? No, thank you. We're going to button you up, okay? Did you like the movie? You did? I liked the movie too. Hey, those are not for playing with. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, it's chilly. Hey, are you coming with us or what? I quite liked Frozen 2. Not as much as is. I recommend it to families with kids. I quite enjoyed the movie. I always spend the night at her parents' house because the family's there and tomorrow's Thanksgiving, but I gotta go home because I gotta take care of these dogs. And I gotta get up to swim tomorrow morning. Man, the house is just so quiet without Allie being here. As always, make sure you guys are following me on social media, at Swim Miller on Twitter and at Cody Miller on Instagram. Vlogs every Wednesdays and Fridays for Vlogmas. Happy Vlogmas. Lots of new Cody Miller merch is available at CodyMillerSwim.com. Go check that stuff out. Next week, there's gonna be a limited run, a special edition Cody Miller t-shirt. It's one of my favorite t-shirts, and it's only gonna be available for a limited amount of time. And once they sell out, it sells out. The best way to ensure that you get one of the t-shirts that is the limited supply is to sign up for that email list so you get notified immediately when it becomes available. I'm really excited about this. Like the fact that I have my own clothing and stuff, it's like, I never thought I would be doing this. Cody Miller Swim. Okay, until my next video, I will see you guys later.